Wario is still proud of me, guys. Hey there, everyone. It's Cloud Calvin, Wario Land 2. Last time, after I saw the screen, I forgot I wouldn't take a chance and just kind of leave it there and see what happened. Okay, so we do still have our ending. Well, we'll just get the ending a bit late. And now it's called Adding Suspense. Everyone flying out of the poison sewers. Well, I guess it was more like the basement. Sarah sometimes is at different levels of bigger than the booms. Hey, yeah, so now we're gonna start with the gameplay today. You're gonna be different. Uh, Wario still super happy. His hand is huge. He's really glad that we got to the basement of his factory and got his money for him. And I understand that. So let's go on a trip to Wacapulco. W L two stands for Wario Land Two. I uh, know. Can you believe that? I was sure there was gonna be a twist. But the twist is there ain't any! Welcome to Post 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 Irony. Wario is so excited that he's jiggling all over. You know what? Uh, like, look at this belt buckle, look at his arm, look at his, like, his suspenders. Everything is just moving to the beat. Wario, when he's happy, boy howdy, he lets you know. And you know what? That's great. A lot of people out there in reality... Oh my gosh, it's and owl control! Like, a lot of people out there in reality, like, there's this weird sort of shame of displaying happiness. And that's no. If you're happy and you know it, I mean, don't shove in other people's face. But don't be ashamed of it either. I think we did have Owl Control in the first ending, right? Well, I'm just glad to see you again! It's my friend Owl Non-Troll! No, it's a Zaki Nobuhiro. Like, let's be serious here. Look at that owl. Be able to rasp back money upon its head. Not even flat on its head, but on its little, like, feather horns that some owls have. It's not even ears, like, it's just feathers, but they are the hardest feathers you've ever seen! Owl control right into my heart! Owl control right out the door! Now it's the water, there's no time for owl on the water. I mean, this is true, like, of all the pathways, this pathway is the most similar to, like, the mainline one. Just as instead of being at, you know, Syrup's Skull Tower, you're at Syrup's Spike Factory. So, of course, the trip where it has to do is pretty dang similar. But I think those money bags are just kind of glued to one another. Is it just me or does the rope, like the rope that's tying the top of the bag and like hanging to the side, kind of looks like a fancy Waluigi symbol, like the upside down L? I just can't really unsee it. Like, to me, it's just so clear. Except it's just supposed to be rope. Did Waluigi exist at the time of this video game? I think so. I want to say so, but honestly, I just don't know. Hey, it's our pal the bird. Little birds floating around, looking like birds and being very round. Oh, yeah, now I see. The, pro the, pro the thing that's gonna happen with the panel is probably when it does the post credit percentage thing. Ah, uh, I should have I should have figured that one out yesterday. But I was just too impressed by uh, Wario calling me great. I've never had a superstar like Wario call me any adjective before. So I I was just taken aback by you know by the feelings ride inside most of my internal organs, very indiscriminate with its aim. Not sure what I'm talking about anymore, but that's okay. Jim Warnell, you exist. How do you feel about that? Uh, of course, I'm making kind of assumption by your name opinion there. I don't actually know for proof that you exist, but you're in the credit of a game, so there's no reason why it wouldn't be otherwise. Producers, this person. Yeah, have you ever met this person? I haven't. Do we know he exists or she exists? We don't know. Present by Nintendo! Oh, spoilers, I said it just before it appeared. I, I hope that doesn't upset anyone. Birds in the feather, bird town, bird place. Alright, what's gonna happen with the panel? I know, END. Extra neural device, right here. One hundo percento. Also, 100%. On the picture panel, 
somehow also 100. Like, these kind of climbed up together in a way. Oh, man. It goes de -ling -a -ling. I pressed a butt. What's that? What does the skull mean? I guess that's where bosses are at? Alright. GAME! And a side thing there. What? So I need to go there? Alright, let me... Reset the Game Boy. Did you see that? I reset the Game Boy. Oh man, had I known. So, yeah, I know. Great. It's great. Now let's go get Serb's treasure. Alright, so, yeah. So there's a game there, that's maybe the ending? There's a thing here, and it's flashing very, very excitedly. What's this? Flagman DD! What? <laughs> Help me out here. Uh, um. Um. Okay. Let's play. I don't. What am I seeing? It's Flagman! Oh, whoops. Okay, I'm supposed to. Okay, okay, it's just Simon. It's not. It's not that special. I did it! I did it. I pressed this play. This. This is silly. Da 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 da. It's, it's like the song. Playing some Mozart. I'm glad that, thanks to beating the game, I now have accesses. Well, with that said, like, it's... Like, someone took the time to program this, which is kind of funny. Da, da, da. Well, I I don't want to play anymore. This is kind of lame. You know what? I'm, I'm good. I'm good, Dangerous Duck. I get it. Congratulations. You're the world's most powerful duck. I'm just gonna go ahead and exit here, if you don't mind. Last level! The super final! The absolute demon head at the end of the universe. Wario's all like, hey, you stole my money, I got back. But now I'm gonna get the rest of your money. Don't mess with the villain! Rah! Then he just stops, like, oh, this is a pretty mountains. Alright, alright, yeah, you know, right, you know, right. Once the glint appears on the map, he knows to look for the glint under reality. What's that? This just looks like a weird shape. And there's an evil skull zone. Welcome to Skull Cave. I see now how it works. Where is like, I'm gonna steal all your skull caves. Time attack. The really file chat. That's kind of funny. Still a serious treasure. Those are ears. What? <laughs> that's that's why you're getting out of me. The hell? Okay. Well, there's a timer, but it's going up and not down. So it's like whatever, man. I don't, I don't care. It's B. This, this is weird. So how does this work? How, how do you get anywhere? Destroy all the Marmite. Yes, I can't do anything here. There's ears. Like, what is that? Why is that? I don't like it. I mean, I'm trying to destroy everything here, but it's... It's not really... Doing anything. There we go. Okay, because there's that thing there. Or you just kind of crash into arbitrary things here and there. It's fine. It's good. It's okay. You're forgiven. Oh, they really saved their A game for the end here, I see. I appreciate that. Well, I don't know where I'm going. But I'm certainly going there. Alright, here lets me jump up so I can get this silver money. It's like, just like, got all these weird things stuck inside the flesh of the the universe and dang it, how is this gonna work? There's nothing I can throw. I've I've struggled. If I do that, then I can do that. Alright, I solved that puzzle. Uh it's implied I don't have a money total I can see anywhere. Now on the map there was indeed like a treasure box. Well let's press this. 
Well, there's no room for it in the thing, though, in the treasure collection, so I don't know. This is weird. What is that? A mouth? No, it's just a place where dressers fall. You don't got one of those in your weird post-game level? That's weird. What are you talking about? How is this gonna work? Like, eh. Hmm. That, this is a lot of weirdly placed, awkward things sentence. I want to jump, but, like, it just doesn't take long for the, the dresser to just explode. Dang it. Alright, so I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, and yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen. Proud though, there we go, thank you, now I got eyeball fatigue. I don't want that to happen. Alright, I'm now somewhere. Am I supposed to like, jump around that? Uh, I can, if I want to. Do I though? I doubt it. Alright, more of this. Ah, oh, no, let me jump up, let me jump up! Let me jump up, you swine of a video game. All right, okay. All right. Yeah, this is weird. Like it's uncomfortable. No, jump up, jump up. Why do you refuse to do this such? It's weird. Ah oh, man, I'm thinking. All right, that's fine. Uh, no, you gotta, you gotta do a tall jump here. And from the, like, that, eh? Yep. Exactly. I don't suppose... No, I don't think there is. Alright, 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 alright. Progress. Ugh. Okay, now we're gonna be in the top of sphere. It's the sphere on top. Yeah, there we go! There we go! What is that? That's the... The bull boss, isn't it? Dude. This door isn't flush on the sphere, so I don't know about that. Listen to me. Listen to me here. This is a deal that you can't let go of. Alright, where... Okay. From there you can... Make this happen. Awkward for everyone. I could go up there, but that wouldn't be fun. There's weird groves now everywhere. I don't know what to think. Don't know who you are. If I knew everything I didn't, I probably wouldn't be here at all. It's true. Alright, I made that book jump, so as far as I'm concerned, my memory was accomplished. There's no flow. Oh, you're supposed to bring the bug all the way here. That's what you're supposed to I mean, it was kind of obvious, but I didn't do it anyway. Wait, okay, you need to do like a whole bunch of rigmaroles too. Alright, you know what, that's fine, that's fine. Welcome to the realm with no realms. No rams, alright, so... Because, yeah, because like, that's, that's my problem here. It's gonna, like, here... It's, it keeps bopping into things and it's dropping. Alright, so I can do that. And just kind of constantly carrying it around that way, I guess that works. But how do I get it there? I guess I... No, the other way around. No, the other way... This game, this level is just like exploiting everything I love about the physics of this game. It's great. Somehow they know. Okay, no, wait a second. I can't... Ah, come on, dude. Because, like, I don't want to throw him because... What? Because then he's gonna explode. Like, and I'm just gonna have to start over again anyways. Well, I guess I can do a gentle throw. Okay, that's good. But see, now the problem is... Um... No, no, stay, stay! Right? No, stay, no! Uh... No, shut up, stop it. No, this is not going to work. Like, it feels like that's why that's there, but I just don't think that's gonna work. So I'm gonna try and bring it over like this. Alright. This is... Like, if I put it there, 
They'll start walking around. Okay. I can follow it from behind. It's everything I love about everything I love. Alright, just... Eh, 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 eh. No, don't fall all the way here. You dum-dum. You dummy. They really say they're la their best level for last. Alright, so... I can even destroy this here for fun. No more eggs. No more eggs. Just a whole lot of mouths. Hey, smile! It's the teeth zone. Alright, I guess I'm gonna carry you around then. Wait, is this... 1-8, uh... Yeah. That's weird. <laughs> yeah, it's just flat out, uh... 108. Alright. Good job just stealing ideas from Nintendo. Jump team. <laughs> also, this feels super bad. In case that wasn't really obvious from just watching me try to handle this. Like, you always need to be... Why did you grab him there? What? How did that happen? You need to be constantly just like on the right side. But if you go too much on the right, you grab him. You don't want... Nah. Come on, really? Dude, like, I couldn't even see him. He was off screen when I jumped. Alright, I mean... Can't do much about it. No, I'm going to just laugh. If to get the treasure, you need to be the level, like, under five minutes or something. Because that's going to be... Real bad time. But... Something you can do when that happens, but laugh. Alright. Jerk phone. That's right. Alright, so, not again. So like this time, you gotta bounce on the other side of them. Which is, you know, this isn't any harder or anything. Dang it! Uh, this is just several layers of discomfort. Alright, okay, he came back. That's good. It's good to come back sometimes. Return to your sender. Dang it! In case you haven't understood what you're doing yet. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! But why did he catch him? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Like, how is that physically possible? I should be bouncing on him, so how did he catch? No! He Like, that's not hard, it's just weird. It doesn't feel great. Wow, like this. Like, weird, like... <laughs> Alright. Eh. So you gotta hold... You gotta diagonal it. Oh, boy. Because you have to be pressing up, and, you know, your, your timing needs to be really good. Like, maybe there's a way to do it. Because there is no momentum in this game. I guess you could just, like, place yourself and do your jumps from there. And there's no real urgency. That's a bird. That's a way up. That's a bird. Yeah, see, I wanted to, like, hop on him. But it didn't happen. There's birds there. What are you showing me? I have no idea. Okay, he turns around. Got it. This is like anagrams. I don't know what that sentence meant, but oh boy. Yeah, like the bird needs to be there. So okay. So like in mid mid, you just you just gotta go. You just gotta go. No time for waiting around. Just... Get. Get! Get! Alright, so... What is the lore? Oh, wow! Here it forces you to know that weird... I guess it's officially not a glitch anymore, but an actual in-game on-purpose function. That's pretty wild. Basically, if you tackle and you duck immediately, he does a brrrr sound. But more importantly, 
He keeps his momentum. It's very awkward and looks dumb. How do you get past this? I don't know. Like, that worked. So you gotta, you gotta jump at the last. Or you can, I'm trying to duck jump, but like, you just don't. Oh, are you supposed to like do a dashing duck jump? Because, well, I, that's why I just kind of tanked it. It was not very pretty. Alright, here it gives me an opportunity to flatten. The, the walls are crying. Okay, and that's to get over there or over here. Either or, or vinegar. It's cool. Flatten me out. Oh no, a rock fell in my hand. Oh no, a rock. Dodge the rocks! Snail level. What even is that? Saliva, I guess? Or just teeth juice? The thing everyone has. Don't cry, Wall. Don't spit teeth. Uh, this is just like unhealthy level. Alright, here you swing and miss. Perfect. Perfect. Makes me so happy that that happened. Uh, now my world truly is complete. Alright. Yeah, you cry. You spit. So here I'm not gonna jump. I'm just gonna let myself go. No, that's gonna miss. Come on, get in there. Like, no. Maybe if you let yourself go from here. Almost. from here. There we go! So yeah, it is still just a find the correct place to just drop. And then you get here and you realize, no, this is not what you're supposed to do at all in the first place. Dang it! This is a failure return zone. I was doing the wrong thing from the start. You're supposed to clear the job on top instead, which might explain why it's kind of weirdly hard to get there. That would indeed explain this. I'm not supposed to make that jump. Gonna be good? Nope. There we go. I had it kinda wrong. I had made implications that were not true. But there we go. I, I, I'm still very annoyed though. Uh, oh, it's kill the spear guy. Alright, I can do that. Wait, what's going on here though in the rest of this room? Alright, it's a door. I mean, like, I don't know if there's, there's a treasure here, is the thing. So I thought it would be best to do thing. Okay, and that leads me back here. Maybe you get a treasure if you destroy him? There's a big weird face. Dang it. Oh, wow, this one's a real annoying battle. Because it does save my money, but, like, if you go here, like, there's no, there's no room. So, I, I don't... How do we get out of here? Yeah, you kind of have to alternate from left to right. It's an actual challenge to the spear, man. That's kind of incredible, you know? You gotta know what you're doing. Moving back and forth. Okay, there's no treasure back there, so there's no treasure treasure there. Wario's happy cucumber. Now you save, and the save completes, and... Oh, 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 let's see what happens now! You press the switch when we open the great vault. Wario the Pirate's Pirates will claim all of this delicious salt. Uh, or at the very least, this passage that leads to the, the cellar. It's a big old money bag! Check it out, it's a big bag of money. It's made of burlap, there's a cool skull design on it. It's perfect. Wario's feeling feelings of euphoria, which I do not share at all. What a weird, awkward level at the end. Like, it's just kind of bad. 
Like, there's no really other way, the words for it, I feel like. It's just really weird. I mean, it's... Like, it's just basically, it's just, it's a level focused on platforming on an engine that is way better at fostering exploration and trying things out. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Maybe it's because I was taken by surprise. It's just that a lot just feels, like, it's weird. Like, you think the lack of momentum would make things feel more precise, owl control? But it's like the opposite setting. I'm 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 going to blame it on an off day. You know what? I'm gonna put it that way. It's gonna be <laughs> Oh no, poor owl! <laughs> Stop shocking the owl, Wario! Clearly the sack of money is way too heavy. <laughs> poor owl. <laughs> oh there we go. It found its second wind. Hopefully it'll be enough. <laughs> Uh, it's pretty funny. But, but like, kind of get like, I don't want a button in case something happens, so here we go. This is the video that is bookended by two complete credit sequence. This game was pretty fun overall, though. Like, honestly, it was really fun. And it's kind of unfortunate that I missed out on the Greater Wario Land series as a kid, but what can you do, right? Uh, yeah, I'm really happy playing this, and I'm looking forward to playing Warland 3, though it's not gonna be for a little while. We're gonna be playing some other video games in the meanwhile, in the meantime. Uh, I'm coming up next, by the way, uh, it's not an official Nintendo game, it's not a ROM hack, it's not a Smabex, it's, uh, well, you'll see. The story of getting that game to run my computer is long and weird. Uh, that's Wario, which jiggly, jiggly Wario. The coin bag doesn't jiggle. Maybe it's not a coin, though. Maybe it's just like a big piece of bread that has that shape and size. It's very possible. We gotta look at the package manual and the design. Uh oh! Oh no! <laughs> that guy has been following us all this time. It's Giant Spearman, the true leader of the pirate and keeper of the great. Pirate homunculus sealed away in the pirate mountain by stealing away the giant burling sack that contains the homunculi's brain. Well, who know what kind uh, of devastation this will cause. I guess something we're gonna learn about in the sequel, although somehow I doubt my interpretation. Like, I don't think that's the ending they're gonna consider as, uh, the valid one, as a can one. It's probably the one at the end of the Underwater Ruins. If I were to make my, my guess as which one is canon. Special thanks to Jim Wernall! Yeah, everyone! Give Jim Wernall, uh, an applause! Give him a hand! Clappity clap! I'm not hearing anyone here. Look at how big the thing is. It's huge. Wario can barely fit in his door. That money just kind of phases. Come on, you can go in. Wario can go in. There we go. Yeah? Okay. What's... What's gonna happen? This is... What kind of violence is gonna happen now? I'm curious. Now you got a guy in, you got Wario in, and the music goes na 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 it's Aunt Dada, you beat the game, I cleared 100%, technically over 100%, I, I cleared like 100% plus 1. Treasure and picture panel though are 100, so final stage, yeah, I got a gold star. What, is there any difference if you get a good time? Cause there was a lot of shenanigans on that thing, I thought, yeah I know, it's there. There we go. I like how they show little skulls everywhere. That's kind of funny. It's kind of funny. So, wait, is there a way to get the treasure to show anything? Yeah, I mean, I'm guessing maybe if you beat the level fast enough, but without actually knowing, I'm just gonna leave it there. 